Uh, every good race needs a t-shirt. Yeah, that's right. I was going to say runners, but keep going. Okay. Well, with all of those people coming to town, one Millinocket native decided to design a logo for the event. She's putting it on t-shirts, blankets, tumblers, and whatever else you can think of. Brady McCatton gives us a look. Press this down and it's got to cook for 60 seconds. Lindsay Adams may now live in Sydney, but a piece of her heart will always be in her hometown of Millinocket. I swear I could go anywhere like Boston or a different state and someone I meet always knows someone from Millinocket. Everyone knows about Millinocket. Hey, I used to vacation there or, you know, my family and I used to go there during the summer. So it's it's fun to hear all those stories and be like, that's where I'm from. With Millinocket in the path of totality for April's eclipse, she's excited for all the visitors who will get a chance to fall in love with the place that shaped her. And if they want to bring a piece of Millinock at home with them, Adams has just the thing in mind. I actually was just scrolling through on Facebook and I happened to see the event and I saw someone post that they were wondering if t-shirts and tumblers and things like that were going to be made. So I emailed the event organizer and I, I asked him, I was like, is it okay? He's like, go for it. You're a small business and you're local, so that'd be great. Take it right out to my laser. Lindsay is the owner of Mama Bear Corner, an online shop specializing in custom creations. With the blessing of Gary Allen, who's behind the Millinock Eclipse race, she got to work designing a logo. So I did like the eclipse. It just says Millinocalypse and then it says Millinock at Maine and then it has the date for the eclipse. They come in different colors. So I have, you know, purple and red. I'm doing t-shirts and hoodies and crew necks. I'm also doing tumblers or I could do mugs. Basically, I can do anything custom. So really, if anyone's like, hey, can you put this on a hat? I could do that too. Adams is already counting down the days until April, when the Golden Road will be packed once again, hopefully with people wearing one of her creations. When I was growing up in Millinocket, we always had big events. Like I can remember 4th of July, they'd close off Main Street, everything was packed and you know, you couldn't even barely walk anywhere. And now it's kind of slowed down a little bit, but they're starting to have more big events. And it's great to go back with my son and my family and see that going on there now. Brittany McHatton, WABI TV 5 News, Sydney. If you want to get your hands on one of Lindsay's Millinock Eclipse creations, they're on sale now at mamabearcorner.com. I love the name of that website. T-shirts will be soon available at Katahdin General Store 2, and the first 25 orders from her site will get a free pair of Eclipse viewing glasses. Very